Hello, this is Tom Sillis. I'm the CEO of wetcrow.com. Uh, wetcrow.com is a, is a platform for, uh, for pre-priced services where customers can go in. They find pre-priced services, uh, pre-defined. Uh, they pay for it. They make the, the appointments already uh, there. They select an appointment. They pay for it, and bam, uh, the handyman comes out and th- does a service for them, Okay. Uh, now, you know, this type, type topic of this is top marketing methods for handyman. Okay, maybe not all you guys uh, are, <coughs> excuse me, are signed up with wetcrow.com where we already sell the business for you. Uh, and, you know, in some cases, in some, you know, we don't obviously service all areas. So if you're out in outlying areas where we haven't gotten to your area yet, you're going to have to find other ways of, of doing it. You, you have social media you got uh, all types of things. Uh, you got Google Ads. You got all of that stuff, uh, and then of course you got uh, you got Angie's List, Home Advisor, and those guys. You know they sell leads, and uh, they you know they rape you. I, I have videos on that. You can watch my other videos. Uh, uh, st- you know, never buy, uh, stop buying leads. Uh, do this instead. You can watch that video, and you'll learn a lot more. Okay, um, I'm going to get right into it. Uh, the best way, because this video is going to be kind of short. Uh, the best way to do it is I find the most, uh, you know, the most uh, successful is I do uh, I, I do the uh, what do you call it? door hangers. Okay, very easy to do. You order them; they're for seventy eight dollars for three hundred of them. It costs you like twenty five per hundred. Not even that if you buy like a, a thousand of them. I go out there for every hundred homes it takes you about an hour. Uh, if you have somebody in your family to help, you do one side of the street, the other person does the other side, and you finish up quickly. You do that every day in the morning. Uh, so when people wake up or they're going to work, they see their their door hanger in the door, okay? Uh, very effective. Have it professionally done. Let them design it for you, the companies. They charge you like 20 bucks the first time, then you just repeat your order. I mean, it's just a lot easier. Uh, they'll, they'll do a nice job, list all your services on the back, do double-sided, show a handyman picture in the front, and, uh, you know, uh, you know tell, and make sure, number two, you got to have that phone answered. The worst thing you can do is do that, and they're calling you, and it goes to voicemail. Guess what? I'm going to tell you a little dirty trick. 80% of customers will not leave a voicemail. They're going to call up somebody else. They want to get an immediate, uh, you know, response, Okay. Have some, you know, there are services out there to handle. They, you know, you could look for a handyman call center. Or, you know, there's different ways of Googling it. There are companies that do that special. They specialize in that. They're already trained on all of the kind of services that you guys probably do. So you're going to go out. You're going to call. They call. You. They're going to answer the phone for you. They're going to say, what's, your, what's the situation you got? I need a totally replace. Okay. You should have a price already set up for that, okay? And that's with the floor being okay. And he, and the girl will tell him, okay, here's the deal. It's going to cost you two hundred thirty nine dollars to install the floor to have the new, um, you know, the new uh, what do you call it, toilet put in. But if we find that there's rotted wood, because normally in about thirty percent of all cases, the floor beneath the toilet is rotted, which is why you have to replace the toilet in the first place. It was leaking. Okay, so you tell the customer that, so they have expectation. Okay, it's going to be between two hundred and uh, and seven hundred dollars to do that. I got to get it done anyway. I'm not. I'm trying to sell the house. I got to fix this. I can't. Uh, I won't be able to sell the house without it, or it's an emergency. Okay, so use the door hangers. You're going to get a uh, three to five percent response if you do them correctly, do them professionally. Have your phone answered. It's going to, I don't care if it costs you a hundred dollars a month. It's the best money you spend. You'll get three to five percent every hundred. You'll get three to five customers. Okay, if you put out a thousand, you spend maybe a whole day, and you do this every three four weeks. You hit areas, you rotate, and then you you're going to be back at the original area within a month. Hit them one more time. Until you build up enough uh, referral business, then you can slow down a little bit. You can use wetcrow.com if we're in your area because uh, we get you the business. You just go out there and do the job, one job after the other, okay? Because that's what we do. We actually, you know, we actually, the customer sees the price. They see what we do. They book it. They understand that they're going to pay more if the floor is rotted. And they know that, okay? They already have the toilet there. They bought a Home Depot. Maybe they put it in the back of their trunk or they have they have us pick it up for $75 we go pick it up and bring it to your home uh, between 50 and 75 depending on the area okay it's that simple so learn you know learn how to make money uh, the right way don't be going on credits and advertising because uh, you're going to attract the wrong customer you're going to attract the cheapskates they're going to nickel and dime you to death 
I, pro I promise you, you're going to get the shit customers. I hate to say it. Uh, plus, you're going to appear like you're a scammer because most contractors don't have a license. They go on Craigslist and advertise, of course. So you see what I'm saying? So, and then uh, go in the better, uh, the high, the higher paying areas. Every area, I don't care if you're out in the boonies, you have areas where people have money, okay? So if you go and do those neighborhoods first, okay, you're going to make a lot more money. They're not going to bicker with you. They're going to be professional with you. They're going to pay you. They're going to they're gonna pay you for the service. You're not going to get where they don't want to pay you unless they're sick or something and you give them an invoice and they don't pay it after a while. Or if you're doing uh, pressure washing and they're selling their home, yeah, if you don't collect your money right away, uh, you got to tell the customer the money's due on, on, uh, on finishing the job. Now, if you're not home, the money's due. We're going to leave the invoice uh, in your door. And uh, that's due uh, within a week, okay? After one week, we put a lien on your house. That's it. Just be very adamant. That's how we operate because pr we know that a lot of people do it before they move. Then they stiff the, the pressure washing guy. So, you know, these are things you learn. You do as you, uh, as, as you, you know, experience the, the stuff in your business. Uh, there's a guy named Mike. He talks about it. He's a pressure washing guy. You know, he, he's in North Carolina. He talks about this stuff, so... Uh, you can watch his videos. Uh, so anyway, that's uh, that's what, what I got today. I gave you a lot of tips. So we're going to summarize door hangers for advertising. Get your phone answered somehow. If it's your wife, she should know about your business. You should be able to give a price for installing a toilet. You shouldn't have to, oh, let me go look at it and give you a quote. Bullshit. Because when I, if I have somebody come out and he charged me $300, I'm going to kick you out the door. I'm You know, if I'm a customer and I didn't expect that, okay? So people... Pretty much, a lot of people know. Some people don't know. They buy a toilet at Home Depot. They see a price of anywhere from one eighty nine to two twenty nine. Okay, it used to be when I used to uh, do lead generation at Home Depot. It used to be one eighty nine, and that was like uh, seven years ago. So it's probably like two twenty nine now, maybe even two fifty. Uh, so don't be alarmed if you're a customer. Uh, you know, you want to make sh uh, you want to have prices. So if the customer thinks it's too much, let him hang up. Let him go somewhere else. Let him shop around. You know what? At the end of the day, they're going to come back to you because probably you're going to be the cheapest, or and you don't want to be the cheapest. Believe me. And I tell the customer, look, it's we're a little we're a little pricey. It, it seems to be pricey because everything's gone up. We're you know we're trying to be as reasonable as possible, but we do a much better job because we're very thorough in how we do things. Some people just come in because they're afraid of not getting paid, uh, and they just uh, replace the toilet and they walk at the door. In the meantime, your floor is rotted underneath. I'd rather a guy be honest with me and show me. I want to see that the floor is rotted. They show me, here's your floor. It's all rotted. You can see it. Okay, we need to replace it. Okay, now we've got to replace the whole floor if it's linoleum. Whatever the case may be, you got to understand uh, you know, what he's going to charge. And if he's, you know, if he's reasonable, he's gonna, you're going to know that. He's going to, be, he's going to have uh, a lot of Google reviews uh, probably. Okay, you want to find him on Google if possible. Search his name. You're going to find him. He's going to have a website. Uh, you know, if he's a, unless he comes to us, okay, because we have handymen that are single man operation. They don't have the, you know, they don't have the budget for that. Because if they're doing six jobs, uh, five, six jobs a day, they're making maybe a thousand a day and they're happy, okay, and they just want to go home afterwards. They don't want, they don't want to have to deal with answering phones and all that stuff. So that's fine. Uh, they want to see everything, and it's different if you're doing if you're doing a custom job. We we generate leads. We give them to our handymen that are working with us and are doing four jobs on average a day. We give them those leads because they might want to do a big job that's remodeling a kitchen or doing something along those lines. Okay, because we know if they're good at what they do, they're gonna do well for you as well. You're gonna do well. That's it. Uh, thank you very much. They summarized it. I think we went through everything. Uh, please subscribe to my channel, like this video, and hit the notification bell because I put a lot of videos that will help you make money as a handyman uh, a lot better. We got guys making two, 3000 a day. Uh, so, you know, like I said, if you do everything right, you're going to make a lot of money. You're going to be sitting in the money, okay? You're going to be very happy with your results. Again, thank you very much. Subscribe to this channel, like this video, and hit the notification bell, and we'll see you on the other side. Thank you very much.